Gloves! Protect your fingerprints with gloves! The doors are closing. Please stay away from the doors. I made it just in time. Hi, Mia. The train almost left without you. You shouldn't keep your boyfriend waiting. Oh no, I'm not going on a date. I'm going somewhere way more important. <laughs> Are you done with your application? Yes, here it is. Thank you. Just let me check you filled up everything. All right, Miss Beatrice Torres. You're studying aerospace engineering and you're looking for an international internship in the UAE? Yes, I want to work on the Mars Scientific City project. Oh, what's that? It's the city they're building in the desert of the UAE to simulate and prepare for the first human colony on Mars. Wow, I must say I'm surprised. I know, right? A real Mars colony, I mean, it's still a hundred years away, but... I meant I'm surprised you want to actually work in your field. Huh? Come on, a woman aerospace engineer? I thought that was the kind of major girls study to pass the time while they get married and become housewives. <laughs> what? Uh, anyway, the University of Toloa can be your sponsor, but first I'm going to need your love number. Huh? I wrote down my parents' number right there. But you're 22, aren't you? Well, yeah, but I've been so busy with school that I haven't gone to love yet. Keeping a perfect GPA isn't easy, you know? <laughs> you saw my GPA already, right? I did. However, at your age, your GP doesn't mean a thing without a left number. So I'm afraid the university can't help you until you go and register. What? But that's not fair! Aren't scholarships supposed to be earned? What does love have to do with my studies? Everything, Miss Therese. Your left number is what is going to determine how big of a scholarship you can get, and your GP will take it from there. Look, I have a friend who works there. This is her business card. Call this number and make an appointment. The Central Luff office is right outside the Independence Plaza station. You can't miss it. Come back after you've registered and we'll talk about your future, okay? Good luck! Have a nice day! Mm. Stupid bureaucracy! Well, I don't know what you were expecting. You've been putting off going to Luff for months now. Didn't I tell you to register before your appointment at the financing office? Yeah, you did. This isn't like you, B. You're usually on top of these things. Is something the matter? Well... Don't tell me you're worried you won't get a good match. Look, B. There are millions of people living in Toloa. You're bound to find someone who matches you. But if you're still not confident, you can register as a buy and have your pool doubled. That's what I did. Sure, but I'm not buy like you, Lily. Oh, <laughs> yeah. It's just that it's not fair. I've been working all my life for this. Getting perfect grades. Volunteering left and right? Heck, I even tutored kids! And now, it turns out that all that matters is something I don't even have control over. The education system is bull! Shh! B, we're going to get kicked out! I know, I know, I'm just so nervous. What if I get a low percentage? And I can never get that scholarship! I want to go to the UAE so bad, Lily. Oh, B. Look, all that work wasn't for nothing. Because even if you get a 50% match, 
all your voluntary work and your GPA will almost certainly guarantee you get a good scholarship. And if you still need money, your parents could probably loan you the rest. What is their love number again? 60? 70? 75. With that number, I'm pretty sure most banks would give you them a loan with minimum questions asked. They loan you the money in turn, and you could start paying them back once the Mars guys hire you. Is that not what you wanted to hear? No, thank you, Lily. What would I do without you? <laughs> Always a pleasure to save your life. Just remember, if it's meant to be, it'll be. So you might as well go for it, right? Alright, Luff, you win.